Yeah, we can meet the holy people because they could talk about the sunrise and yeah. Baba, Mahadu. If I call up Ricky and just say Warwick's had enough. No, but I don't. I won't want to be the one that's to blame, do I? Why not? Because I'm not saying that we shouldn't stay here. What's the worst that can happen? Hello, here they are. How many of them are they? Like he's drunk a bit. Yeah, welcome. Welcome to the camp. I don't know what's happening. Where's, where's, Rami, what's happening here? They, they seem a bit like angry. No, no, it's their life. They have life. Yeah, I know that. The wise will see They are not angry. They don't sleep. They don't sleep. Well, that's what we'll be like in a couple of days. <laughs> Can we ask about the sunrise? Do you enjoy I, the sun? He's never up in the morning. Yes, he's getting hammered till 3 a.m. He's asleep when the sun comes up. There is no way he's ever seen the sunrise. He's up his tits. We can get a hotel, mate, seriously. Right, OK. Right, let's knock it on the head, because this is getting a bit fucking silly, this. Brilliant, Warwick. Bring him over, he said. Bring him over. Good to have some company. We're in the middle of nowhere, peace and quiet. This oh, just doesn't want to be part of it, does he? Look at him. He's thinking, what am I involved in here? Uh, why is he here? Why is he knocking about with these? Is it that tough to make new friends? See, maybe there is something good in Twitter and Facebook and MySpace and that. It gives you a chance to meet new people. If you live in the middle of nowhere, knocking out with knobheads. I'll tell you what, I'm not staying here tonight. I'm not interested. I'm not having him as a neighbour. Bollocks to the sunrise. Yes. 